Oh, good morning. Saturday the 9th, I struggle with that, of February 2019, 06.35 hours, Greenwich Mean Time, Zulu Time. It was a bit blowy, it still is a bit blowy actually. Uh, there was a yellow wind warning, but the rain has stopped now. I'm off to Panarth, and this is Church Street Bedwest. Well, hopefully international. Well, it just was a cloudburst, a haily cloudburst. Well, Dingle Road International. That way be Panath, and that way be Home. And there's the there's the quality bridge I'm taking. Custer, Bracky. Uh, the smell of the bacon. It is a bit blowy. No one's it is Anyway, the bit is head. And so we start with the carpet, Mr. Manning, because he does like a nice weather spoons carpet, which are all unique, and some of them rather expensive. Anyway, moving on. Uh, Cody, uh, we need to get over to Miwi. Um, black Gold, 4.4% alcohol by volume from the King Gorm Brewing Company. Apparently, Champion Beer of Scotland 2013. Six years ago. Never mind. £2.15 a pint. That's what you get for coming to the seaside. Ooh, that is full. It tastes like it's barrel aged. There's a bit of oaky, whiskey, whatever that's in there. A little bit of burnt coffee, burnt notes in the finish. I'm thinking B plus in a bit. Not only thinking it, giving it. Number two. Um, this is one of those brewed for JDW, brewed for Weatherspoons. Um, Young Henry's Stayer. Uh, I don't know where the hell this food actually is at the moment. Let me check. I do have a, a photo of it somewhere. Um, brewed by Banks's Brewery in Wolverhampton. 3.8% alcohol by volume. Nicely presented. I think my nose is still out of action. Ooh, light, fruity, tropical, citrusy, refreshing. Must be plus in a bit. I like that. It's a bit summery, which is more than can be said for the weather outside. The wind has dropped. Although it's still blowy, and it's stopped raining, and there's a bit of sun. And this is the Golden Lion, and it's rather good. Tires, and then carpet. Okay, so this is from Pixie Spring. The reviews mostly come from the hot bunker. I don't know what Gaza's relationship is with this. 4% alcohol by volume, Citra. The reviews are good. It's murky. What's that like? Mmm. Lemony, citrusy, nicely bitter. Really nice bitter finish. I don't know. I'm going to say B++. I wonder who does it. What did that post that Michelle posted say? It will stick to the side. However, uh, some of the beach can be doing cold, 4.2% of the holiday money. The Man United game is on. Ah, uh, smells a bit 
Tropical and sweet malt. Ew. I'm thinking B plus in a bit. The Paxi. It's the father fish bar. Mm -hmm. It's not glowy, but it's dry. The bottle shop. Right next to Panath International, which is handy. My beer is called Edna. I've never drunk a beer called Edna before. However, Edna's only 3.8% alcohol by volume, so Edna is gentle, which is nice. Pressure drop brew. So, uh, slows and see the storm berry. Ooh, Edna is very nice. Edna is B plus plus. We are drinking Spanish España. A margarita goes. This is no gooey from Napa beer. Had to look up the um, website. They are Spanish. And <coughs> a sharp fruity aroma. Tart, sour, bitter. Citrusy, it says lime, but I'm not getting a lot of lime in there. 4.5% alcohol by volume. B plus in a bit. It's good. Oh, this year we're off to sunny Spain, Aviva, España, or something like that. <laughs>